talking about the hyperbole rock but it interacts with five abiotic facts. It interacts with soil because it, high, it takes burrows from the crawfish, which we've already talked about, and it, that's how it interacts with soil, it hibernates in it. So when it, uh, when we teach you about the water snake, or the copyright water snake, the copyright water snake tends to stay in the shadows during hot days. Water snake interacts with abiotic factor water because one, it's its habitat. It tends to stay in the deeper parts of the swamp. And two, um, it catches its prey in the water. Water snake breathes in through its nose, breathes out through its nose, just like a human. Tends to move around a lot more during the spring and fall temperatures. And, but doesn't move around as much in the hot summer temperatures and hibernate during um, winter. Valley water snake.